As the sun began to rise over the enchanted forest, a gentle breeze stirred the leaves, creating a soft whispering sound. Charlie the squirrel awoke to the soothing rustle and stretched his tiny limbs. Today was a new day, and he felt a sense of excitement in the air. The mystical music tree from their last adventure still lingered in his thoughts, but he knew there was always more to discover in their magical forest. Charlie scurried out of his cozy nest and headed towards the clearing where his friends often gathered. As he approached, he saw the fox and the owl already deep in conversation. Good morning, everyone. Charlie chirped, his eyes sparkling with curiosity. Good morning, Charlie, the fox replied, flicking his bushy tail. We were just talking about the strange whispers we heard last night. Did you hear them too? Charlie nodded. I did. It was like the wind was trying to tell us something. The owl, wise and observant, hooted softly. Indeed, I believe the wind carries messages from the heart of the forest. We should follow the whispers and see where they lead us. With a sense of determination, the trio set off, guided by the gentle whispers of the wind. They ventured deeper into the forest than they had ever gone before. The trees grew tar, and the light filtered through the leaves in a kaleidoscope of colors. As they walked, the whispers became clearer. They spoke of an ancient grove hidden deep within the forest, a place where the oldest and wisest trees grew. According to the wine, this grove held secrets that could help them protect their magical forest and the music tree they had discovered. After hours of walking, the friends arrived at the grove. It was a serene and sacred place, with towering trees whose branches seemed to touch the sky. The air was filled with a sense of wisdom and peace. In the center of the grove stood a magnificent tree, its bark shimmering with a silvery glow. This must be the great elder tree, the owl whispered in awe. The tree's branches swayed gently as if acknowledging their presence. Suddenly, the wind picked up and the deep, resonant voice filled the air. Welcome, young ones, you have come seeking wisdom and guidance. Charlie stepped forward, his heart pounding with anticipation. Yes, great elder tree. We wish to learn how to protect our forest in the magical music tree. The great elder tree's leaves rustled, and the voice continued. To protect the forest, you must first understand its magic. Each tree, each creature, and each whispering wind is a part of this magic. Respect and nurture them, and they will help you in times of need. The friends listened intently, as the great elder tree shared ancient tales and knowledge. They learned about the balance of nature, the importance of every living being, and the power of unity and harmony. The whispers of the wind had led them to a treasure trove of wisdom that would help them safeguard their home. As the sun began to set, the great elder tree gave them a final piece of advice. Remember, young ones, the magic of the forest is within you. Trust in yourselves and in each other, and you will always find a way to protect what you hold dear. With hearts full of gratitude, Charlie the fox and the owl thanked the great elder tree and started their journey back home. The whispers of the wind now felt like old friends, guiding them with gentle encouragement. As they reached the edge of the grove, the wind carried a final message to them. Never forget, the magic of the forest is a part of you. The friends returned to their clearing feeling wiser and more connected to their enchanted forest than ever before. They knew that no matter what challenges lay ahead, they had the knowledge and the strength to overcome them, united by the magic of the forest.